So I'm in the process of upgrading. I just did a linear rail uh, upgrade, uh, as well as a BMG. I did the E3D. Um, I've got another, I've got a couple other uh, V6s that I'm gonna use. That's that's torn to shit. So, <laughs> so I got another one I'm using. Um, but yeah, it was, it was interesting using the, the BMG um, for this. And it's definitely, uh, hold on. It's definitely not the vinyl design. I'm gonna have it out of aluminum uh, for the, the, the fixture and the plate, uh, for the stepper motor, but I also did a direct drive uh, uh, conversion. So I, I just want more reliability. I, I know there's weight, but the, the reason I have this here is because this bounces perfectly on here. So the weight is balanced pretty well. I mean, the only thing you're gonna you know have an issue with with direct drive barely uh, I mean if you're pushing the limits is is you know returning uh, to the other direction right and stop and go and so anyways it's very 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 smooth and so I've got a lot of work to do uh, I was trying to lighten some uh, get, get access to some some stuff so I, I kind of chewed the fuck out of that so anyways um, I also got the dual Z um, axis I know my room's fucking messy so all right so yeah Dual Z, mechanical linked. Um, I also got the coolest thing. Um, I know you guys know about this, but this is the 2GT um, low vibration, right? There's a company that was making the low vibration uh, model. So this is Gates Power Grip uh, GT, right? There we go. That's the one. Hold on. There we go. So yeah. This is all gates, so everything's gonna be gates now. So I also, oh yeah, the biggest thing is this is a point, this is a point nine stepper motor. So that's the biggest thing. So point nine stepper motor. Uh, I mean, you really want to read the whole bill. I have all that. Yeah, the duet as well. So that's that's everything that's there now. Yeah, I'll uh, keep you guys uh, updated. It's just gonna take a lot of work, a lot of time, but I had to custom make the uh, idler because this is, was not gonna mount. So I, I, I just, there was a lot of clearance issues. So I just reused some of the parts, the bearings, and they made a really good spacer. So, you know, the, the same bearings you, you had the wheels uh, from the other assembly was exactly what I used for that. So, uh, yeah, I'll keep you guys updated. I really, really, really excited for this point uh, nine degree stepper motor. It's insane. Um, I forgot who. It's it's almost like a clone of the um, what's that company? Anyways, it's almost a clone of the highest company. I forgot what they're called. But anyways, this one I got is called Stepper Motor Online, right? So it's really, really, it's like the one. Um, E3D uses. I forgot the fucking name. I don't know why, but uh, anyways, they're really, really the best. And the vibration, the quality, it's crazy. So, 0.9 stepper footer, uh, the extruder at least, uh, will help a lot. 